So, apparently, he just won't back down. Well, guess what, Jordan Fringe? Neither will I. What is up, my Breaking Family? Sending some positive vibes in your direction, and it is time for another episode of How Valuable Are My Pokemon Cards? So, this is an ongoing series that both myself and fellow Pokemon YouTuber Jordan French have been doing, battling it out, trying to figure out who can pull the most valuable Pokemon cards, and currently, that's right, your boy, Real Breaking Nate, is in the lead, and I tend to keep it that way. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name's Real Breaking Nate, and I told Jordan Fringe that if he wants to keep going on with this series, I'm more than happy to do so. He knows that the Breaking family is not gonna back down from a pack battle. So here we are, third episode into the series, and currently the Breaking family is in the lead with $68.43. So Breaking family, we are going to try to keep that lead, and Jordan said he is coming in strong this week, and so I figured I would call in some re reinforcement since Jordan is so sure of himself and Jordan I think you might know my friends burning in shadows now I know we can only open up 18 booster packs and this is an entire unopened booster box of burning shadows so I'm gonna go ahead and just grab half of the booster box right here 18 packs and today we are also going to be searching for the hyper rare Charizard GX and if we pull this card right here this is about a two hundred dollar card and that would definitely definitely put us in the lead so hopefully we can pull a hyper rare Charizard GX and there's lots of other valuable cards inside of this set like the secret rare fairy energy and the secret rare fire energy there's guzma in the set there's lots of good and very valuable cards inside this set so let's go ahead and start today's pokemon card opening and there'll be a link to jordan's portion of today's pack battle down in my video description down below so make sure you go and check out his video as well jordan's a great guy and we love jordan this is a nice friendly pack battle that we do here but we also mean business. So $68.43 is currently what our total is. We add up the totals every single week. And then also every, well, not every single week. We do this uh, do this series every other week. But um, in every episode, we try to figure out who pulled the most in that episode. And then uh, we do a grand total uh, of all the episodes together. So it is a continuing every other week series. And we only count the values of hollow rares or better not reverse hollow rares but hollow rares or better so let's go ahead and start off with our very first burning shadows booster pack wimpod energy acerola gloom escape rope alolan vulpix and an electrovire so unfortunately we will not be able to count either of those cards but here is the code card right here and if you don't know both myself and Jordan Fringe host a weekly Pokemon collecting and news podcast called The Shadowless Podcast. It is currently on iTunes and Spotify. Uh, just type in Shadowless Podcast uh, and you should be able to find us. We'll be uploading our fifth episode this Wednesday. It should drop at midnight Eastern Standard Time this Wednesday. And this week's episode, we have our very first ever special guest. And this special guest has recently announced their retirement from YouTube. And everybody should know exactly who this is. Laughing Pikachu is going to be our special guest this week. We'll be talking about Pokemon collecting with her and also about how she got started into YouTube and why she is exactly leaving and retiring from YouTube. So make sure you check that out. And of course, then we'll also talk about the weekly news in the Pokemon world. It's, it's a great episode. We've already recorded it. Drops this Wednesday at midnight Eastern Standard Time. And uh, a great, great first guest, the Laughing Pikachu. is a phenomenal, phenomenal episode. It is almost... It's about two and a half hours long. It's our longest episode we have ever recorded. So make sure you listen to that Shadowless podcast on iTunes and Spotify, a weekly Pokemon collecting and news, a Pokemon news oriented website. Uh, we've been having a blast with it, an absolute blast with it. Lots of great nostalgic conversations on there, as well as talking about newer stuff as well, um, you know and the values of things and just hard items to find. It's, it's such a great podcast, so I really, really recommend to check it out. 
all of you. And if you do check it out, please leave a rating and a review of the podcast. So um, check it out. Let me know what you think about it. Let us know if you've listened to it already. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. And today, are you rooting for Team Real Breaking Nate or are you rooting for Team Jordan Fringe? I mean, Team Real Breaking Nate's in the lead. So, you know, hopefully you're rooting for the right team here. All right. Going into our next Burning Shadows Booster Pack, Caterpie, Sandy Gast, Vinipede, Sneasel, Etch, Energy, Bofalunt, Electric, Rhydon, Raichu, Alolan Muck GX, Full Art, Alolan Muck GX, Jordan, I know you're nervous, I know you're nervous, you're seeing this first pull already, we're what? Four booster packs in, and you've already seen a full art ultra rare Pokemon card. And it's actually a little bit miscut. Look at that. Look at that right there. Wow. Look at that miscut. That is, that's kind of, that's kind of crazy. Nice. I love a good miscut uh, in air Pokemon card. I went to the Sword and Shield pre-release this past weekend, which there is Sword and Shield openings right now here on our channel. And while I was at the Sword and Shield pre-release, uh, a fan gave me this right here. Look at how badly miscut this card is right here. Uh, they knew that I loved miscut and air Pokemon cards and they brought that for me. So thank you so much. Let's go into our next booster pack and you'll never believe, you'll never believe what we pulled in our very first Sword and Shield uh, card opening. It, it's absolutely insane. So make sure you go and check that out. There'll be a link at the very end of today's video. Alolan Grimer, Ryolu, Energy, Gloom, Escape Rope, Soul Rock, Mudsdale, and a Porygon Z. Another, another card that I can add to our total. There's the code card right there. If you're new here to the channel, I always show the code cards uh, that way, if you are interested in them, you can grab yourself a code card. They do go fast, so I always suggest hitting that bell notification icon right at the bottom of your screen. Even if you're not interested in code cards and you just want to come here to enjoy Pokemon with me, nostalgic vintage Pokemon stuff and new Pokemon stuff, I upload four to five times every single week. I usually upload at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and then on the weekends, it's usually about 11 a.m. or uh, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right, Cedra and a Gardevoir GX. Oh, our fairy Pokemon. You will be missed, fairy Pokemon. Well, you're still going to be in the game, but as far as fairy type Pokemon, no more. No more fairy type Pokemon. Let's go ahead and sleeve this up. Sorry, Jordan. Already two ultra rares. It's going crazy in here. I'm taking the hat off. I'm taking the hat off. That's how crazy it's going already. Can we get three ultra rares? Three ultra rares. Jordan, I think we can make it happen. Breaking family. I think it will happen. All right. So Jordan Jordan said he's coming in strong this week. And, I, you know, I figured Burning Shadows is uh, some good reinforcements to call in. Tangula, Tinamo, Crab Brawler, Inke, Energy, Metapod Pod, Wishful Baton, Acerola, Plumeria, and a Crab Abominable. Don't drop the baton. If you remember, bring it on when they go up there or when, when whoever it was that goes up there and grabs it or someone hands them the baton and then purposely drops it and makes it look like the other person dropped it. I don't know. You know what I'm thinking about or am I just rambling on now? Some of you know exactly what I'm think, uh, thinking of. Uh, the original Bring It On movie. I'm not crazy. I know I'm not crazy, okay? Well, I am crazy, but I know what I'm talking about here, okay? Such a classic movie. It really is. We talked about Billy Madison in the last video, and now we're talking about Bring It On. It's uh, some sort of movie review week, I guess. Inke, Ralts, Crab Brawler, Sneasel, Vinipede, Energy, Heatmore, Semiseer, A Mount, Alolan, and a Dusk, Dust Noir, a Hollow Dust Noir to be exact. And I believe. That is another card we can add to our total, Mr. Jordan Fringe. So right there, four cards on our total. Now you're seeing the values on the bottom corner of the screen. 
Um, I don't know as I'm recording this, I have to look after I'm done recording it. Um, and it is the current values as of the recording of this video. And we both use a TCG player as our guide for the current values. So we are on the same level playing field for uh, values. Ladybug, hoot hoot, hoot hoot. You are a bird and what do birds gotta do? Birds gotta fly. Fly away, bird. Alolan Vulpix, energy. Electric, right on. Bodybuilding dumbbells. Let me get some reps in. Ugh, ugh, ugh. You even lift, bro. Tormenting spray. And a Persian, which is a little, a little on the miscut side as well. But we, we can't use it. We can't use it for a value, unfortunately. What do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight booster packs left. I'm actually really confident we can pull another ultra rare in these eight booster packs. I'll put this right over there. Ever so gentle. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, become part of the Breaking Family, a nice positive uh, Pokemon community we have here on YouTube where nobody is judged. This is a judgment-free zone and everybody is welcome here on this channel. Even if you don't like me, you're watching me right now for the first time and you're thinking, wow, that guy right there is annoying, but I'm enjoying his openings. You're still welcome here and I still love you. Lana, Zygarde, and a Lydian. I love everybody, you know? I don't like to spread hate, I like to spread positivity. That's what the world needs more is positivity. And I encourage all of you to spread positivity as well. Don't be negative. Don't, don't try to bring someone's day down. Be positive, be the reason somebody smiles today. Why would you wanna be the reason somebody is upset? Why? That makes no sense. Be the reason somebody smiles. That memory will last with them forever. So be the reason somebody smiles. Dupider, energy. Noctowl, Semipur, Buffalant, Noctowl again, and a Malamar. And our code card once again. We have plenty more Sword and Shield openings coming up here on the channel. We will be starting uh, our Sword and Shield binder where we try to complete the entire set. Of course, we've done that with Hidden Fates, the Hidden Fates binder right back there, and the Sword, uh, not Sword and Shield, but Cosmic Eclipse binder right back over there. We will be doing it with Sword and Shield. So if you have a good suggestion for a sword and shield binder, let me know in the comment section down below. Crap Brawler, Morlaw, Sandy Gas, Vinipede, Energy, Porygon 2, Po Town, coming to Yo Town, Dusclops, Meowth, Breaking Family, Breaking Family, look what we got right here, a Dark Energy, a secret rare Dark Energy. I'm sorry, Jordan Fringe. I'm sorry, I think, I think that right there alone is gonna put us in the lead. Whoo! My apologies. Uh, the Breaking Family is coming in strong. Coming in strong today. A secret rare, Darkness Energy. Whoo! Let's go ahead and sleeve that up. Look at that beautiful, beautiful card right there. Secret rare going right at the very, very top. Like I said, I don't know the values right now because I have to add those in when I'm editing, but you're actually seeing them as the video's going on right now. Um, and I'm pretty sure that's a, that's a valuable card right there. So I think that might put us in the lead for today's video and for overall. We'll find out at the very end of today's video. We'll count up the grand total and today's as well. More lil. Energy, Semiseer, Amount, Electabuzz, Persian, and a Weavile for the rare in that one. Code card goodness. Remember, don't forget to check out the Shadowless podcast. You all, so, so much positive feedback from that. It has been a passion project for us, and we absolutely love doing it. We just sit there and we talk about the latest news in the Pokemon world, as well as just collecting new stuff, nostalgic vintage stuff. And we tell uh, some of our collecting stories from the past. And we also give pretty uh, good information. I feel it's pretty good information throughout the entire podcast. Uh, so don't forget to look for the Shadowless Podcast on iTunes and Spotify. Give it a listen while you're at work. We won't tell anybody on your way to work and in, in your uh, morning commute while you're in the car or riding... Uh, Riding the bus or whatever. I don't know what I don't know what you're doing. Riding the bus to work. I don't know. Whatever you're doing, working out, or you're just sitting at home, doing, cleaning the house. I don't know. 
listening to the podcast, Duskall, I promise it'll go by very fast. Inke, Energy, Tormenting Spray, Lana, Heatmore, Dust Noir, and a Heracross for the rare. We've been doing something really interesting on the podcast. Every single week, we do our Pokemon card picks of the week, where Jordan picks a card and I pick a card from Pokemon history. Any card from Pokemon history, new or old, and uh, we pick a card every single week. And then by the end of the year 2020, we are going to have our very first ever Shadowless podcast set for the year 2020. And we're trying to encourage all of you to collect the set as we go every single week uh, uh, with the episodes every single week. So it, it's been really, really great. We picked out some vintage cards. We picked out some new cards. Guzma, Passimian and a Butterfree. A lot of you have been posting your pictures on social media and tagging us. All my social media is down in the video description down below if you want to find me. Our last booster pack, Breaking Family, do me a favor, give this video a thumbs up, give us some good luck on this last booster pack, and for our grand total overall, I mean, look at this right here. Look at what we got so far, Breaking Family. Last booster pack for today's Pokemon opening, Mutt Bray. Tinamo, Energy, Poe Town, coming to Yo Town once again, Dusclops, Charmeleon, Simipor, gotta give you the code card, there's the code card right there, whoosh, and another Mudsdale, but look at this right here, those are some good pulls, let's go ahead and add up the grand total for today's video, and then overall for the entire series. So even though we didn't pull the Hyper Rare Charizard at GX in today's Burning Shadow Search, we got a lot of high values that I think are going to make up for that. Woo, yikes, uh, Jordan, I'm going to go ahead and apologize right now. So our total for this week right here, not our grand total for the entire series, but our total for this week right here is $41.59, and uh, that's just for this week. So now on to our grand total for every single episode. Once again, I apologize, Jordan. Our grand total is $110.02, and that two cents is very important. I have no idea what values Jordan has pulled in this week's video, so we might not currently be in the lead. I'm gonna have to find out the same time all of you find out, but I'm pretty sure Breaking Family, we're still in the lead. And of course, as always, Breaking Family, thanks for watching the channel and taking the time out of your busy schedule to come and hang out with this weird person right here. If today was a rough day for you, remember that tomorrow is a new day, a new day for you to wake up and give it your best. Don't forget, life is awesome and so are you. I love every single one of you amazing people all around this world and I truly mean that. And I'll see all of you, all of you in the next video. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and high five.